In this video, we are talking about cheap paper towels versus expensive ones and the main differences. So obviously you can see roll size is always going to be a thing. Cheap ones typically have smaller rolls. The more expensive ones, you're definitely getting more product. Uh, the other main thing would be the texture. These ones have a softer feel. I have really sensitive skin, so rough paper towels are the enemy. These ones definitely are thinner and the paper itself is coarser, right? So then we're gonna talk about absorbency and to that end, I have got some blue water and I am just gonna pour a tablespoon on each. We're gonna talk a little bit and then we're gonna lift them up and see how much is left below. Right, so it's gonna go to town there. And there, and you can see even that, it really, really ran across the surface, right? This one, it really started to absorb it really, really quickly. Um, we buy both just because these are great for bathrooms, for the general public, also to have on hand as a backup sometimes when uh, the ones we normally order are out of stock. Uh, and these we keep mostly for spills and messes in the kitchen. They're greater absorbency, uh, and you can see it's more even. We absorb are greater for cleaning up spills in the kitchen versus just drying off your hands in the bathroom and not really needing to clean up any messes. Uh, so we can see if we can see if we lift this up. Most of that in the paper towel, really, really easy. There's just a few little drops there to wipe up versus whoop, there is a lot of excess liquid there and that paper towel is almost used up. So if we give this a quick wipe, right? With the remaining edge, there's nothing left on the table versus if we try to do it with this, we're still smearing stuff around. So the price you spend on your paper towels is gonna make a difference on what kind of job you would use them to do. So in general, we keep the cheap ones in the bathroom for when people are just drying their hands and the more expensive ones in the actual kitchen when we're cleaning up spills. This means we're kind of maximizing our usage. We're using less of the expensive one to clean up our messy, bigger messes and we're keeping the cheap ones for when it only needs to dry a little water off of your hands. And we're kind of maximizing our budget that way and making sure that we're using them effectively.